understood. Yes, Your Honor. <laughs> oh, that is all for today for the travel, Miss May Faye. Oh, yeah, Faye. Miss May Faye. <laughs> I fade, huh? <laughs> Give me a fade! Oh, Court is adjourned. Adjourned. Edgy. I fucking. I had a start trying to read adjourned. <laughs> Oh my god, but yeah. Welcome oh, back. Oh my Jesus Christ. This is this is the longest case I have to fucking finish. Oh my god. Okay. Um Okay, what if I had to present it? Okay, we're just getting right into it. I need to continue this. I don't case. think you need to present. I think you need to go talk about the last part I think it was. I did talk about the last part, no? Wait, no, you kept skipping over or you kept getting Oh yeah, I did. No, you're right. A on accident. Okay. Like twice or three yeah, times. Yeah, 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 you're right, you're right, you're right. You are sure it was misinformation yourself. Uh, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Yes, sir. I said so very absolutely, sir. It is an endearing mannerism of mine. How come you're so very certain? Well, when I brought the room service, sir, she, the guest, sir, favored me <laughs> with an embracer. Oh, shit. Damn. Damn. <laughs> DAMN! <laughs> That's the title of this video, DAMN! <laughs> I think it might be Embracer or something like that. Em embracer. Oh, no, 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 maybe that. Is that, is that the French for embrace? He's it's French. French for a kiss, sir. It's not a French kiss. Uh -huh. It's not a French kiss, sir. It's more like a peck on the cheek. Okay, he's French. Okay. Not British. Okay, British. Okay, okay, I, okay, I thought he got blown off. My bad. <laughs> Oh. oh, he's a bit the boy, yes, sir. <laughs> Why would she have done that? I believe perhaps she was momentarily swayed by my prime demeanor, sir. It was a moment I shall never ever forget. Yeah, Sound... Remember this when he beats off next year, next, <laughs> next match. Sounds pretty fishy to me. I think our Miss May was up to something. It's no good. There's nothing there. Is that it? Fine, you understand. I'm gonna get closer to the mic, actually, nothing about it, since I'm over here. Yeah, you're like all the way in the back. Yeah. This boy has absolutely no- has absolutely no reason to lie. Other than... the embracer. <laughs> now... If you have any... decency, you'll end- you'll end this rather tedious cross-examination here. Hmm! <laughs> it, was, it was quite a bit tedious. The witness may leave the stand. <laughs> I can't let this happen, can I? PROTEST! Wait! Please wait! Yes? The defense has something to add? One last question. Let me ask one last question. Oh, for the love of God. You honor the butt muscle jet. <laughs> this charade of justice has gone long enough. <laughs> no, no, Mr. Edgeworth. Alright, Mr. Wright. I'll give you one more question about- That's it. Okay. This is really it now. This is my last chance. But what to ask him about? Check in. I think he can. I think it's. I think it's that. I can't remember. I think it's check in. She checked it. When did she say she checked in? She checked in. I forgot what she said. She said she checked in at a certain time. I think she. I can't remember. But anyways, I think it's that or room service. I can't remember what, either two. Okay. No. Yeah. It has to be check in. Tell me about the check-in. Tell me about when you checked in, Miss May. All right. Very well, sir. My first thought was she was beautiful, beautiful person. She's just my type of girl, so it was a disappointment, really. I see. Excuse me. What exactly was a disappointment? Well, I am not without charm, sir, but I'd even have a little chance with... Even I'd have little chance with her lover there. What did he say? What did you? <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> oh, uh, rather quiet. Bellboy, tell us the truth now. Did Miss May check in with another person? I object. That was objectionable. Objectionable. Who does want to answer the question? Uh, yes, I see. 
What did you not mention this in your test? Why did you not mention this in your testimony? Well, sir, you uh, you didn't ask. Nice try. That's the sort of thing you're n you're normally supposed to mention. Ah, uh, yes, quite indeed. It was the uh, good barrister there, Mr. Edgeworth, who. <laughs> Motherfucker! <laughs> you snatch! He asked he asked me not to mention it if it, if I wasn't specifically asked, sir. <laughs> you fucking snatch! <laughs> <laughs> you motherfucker! You fool! I've done it. I've won. Mr. Bromaine checked into, into a into a twin room with a man. Correct? Yes, sir. Well, when you brought them room service, you didn't see that man in the room? That's right, sir. Hmm. Your Honor, we have just learned of another person involved who may have been the murderer. In light of this new fact, I hold that it's impossible to judge the defendant. Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Edgeworth? And who, Mr. Ryan? Who was the other person be? <laughs> Simple. It was... <laughs> the bellboy. <laughs> the man who checked in with Miss May. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Your Honor, as has been previously revealed, Miss April May was tapping the victim's phone. Yet Miss May herself has an alibi at the time of the murder. However, that does not clear the man that was with her. The bellboy saw no one else in the room at the time of the murder. What a convenient little setup, but that's too late. <laughs> I mean, it's too late, my man. Ugh. Too late? I suppose you'd like it if it was too late, wouldn't you? After all, it was you who hid the presence of the other man in this court. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> that's the amateur little son of a bitch! <laughs> I'll come and kill you. These accusations are ludicrous. <laughs> Enough! The court acknowledges the defendant's argument. I expect, I expect the prosecution and defendants to look into the, this matter fully. I understood. Yes, Your Honor. <laughs> oh, that is all for today for the trouble, Miss May Faye. My Faye. Miss May Faye. <laughs> I fade, huh? <laughs> Give me a fade! Oh, Court is no. adjourned. Adjourned. Edgy. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking. I had a structure trying to read adjourn. Adjourn? <laughs> September 7th, 2 24 p.m. District Court Defendant Lobby Number 1. Mr. Ray! You are amazing in there! I fucked up so many times. <laughs> really? I think I might be your newest fan! Oh, I was just doing my job, you know, because I'm paid to do it, so... Then again, that other attorney was pretty cool, too. Huh? That face of his, with his eyes wide and trembling lips, it went, it sent shivers up my spine. Don't you mean, don't you mean down? Hmm, <laughs> no. if you say so. So what happens with me? Do I get to go home now? Um, no. <laughs> no, I don't <laughs> think so. Not yet. Oh, I see. But I got a great lead in today's trial. A, a lead? A lead? <laughs> a what? A lead? Do you have a I, gun? I... <laughs> Might walk the metal, not, not a gun. Oh, my Made bad. the joke of lead and lead, how they're spelled, literally spelled the same way. <laughs> that man with his mate, he's the key. Oh, I get it. What happened to Miss Mai after that, anyway? I heard they arrested her. Guess she's learning her charms won't work everywhere. He's probably at the detention center now. I may have to go down there later. For uh, anyway, where's the Trevises? <laughs> <laughs> this case is far from closed. Yes, sir. I'm going to find out more about this man. Do you think he was the one who? Maybe so. Sis, don't worry. I'll find it by tomorrow. I promise. I'm counting on you. Thank you. Uh, can I get my dick so clear? No. <laughs> Not by her. <laughs> <laughs> I asked for a full record of April May's testimony. I thought it might come handy during the trial tomorrow. But now that I have it, I'm not so sure. Most of her testimony was all lies. In fact, there was only one part that had to been stricken from the record. May's testimony added to the court. I don't know how 
much good this will do for me at all now. Anyway, time to hit the pa pavement and do some investigating. Maya doesn't belong in that detention center, and it's up to me to set her free. To be continued. And we have nine minutes right now. We'll continue a little bit of it. I'm probably, I don't know, catch up to it. Ah. Uh -huh. All right, let's do it. Yes, save, please. Ow. Okay, I'm, I'm going to do it again just in case. All right, there you go. <laughs> Gotta do that double save. <laughs> September 7th, 3 11 p.m. Detention Center Visitor's Room. Well, hello. I didn't expect anyone to visit me in such a dang place like this. <laughs> it's really quite moving. Not you, sticking lawyer. I hope you die. Have you come to laugh? Yes, laugh at the following this May. No, not really. There's something I wanted to ask. Unfortunately, there is nothing I want to be asked. <laughs> Have you done enough questioning, you spiky head? Here we go again. Please, you're scaring the security guard. So, what is it you wish to ask of me then, hmm? For starters, how did you get to be totally whacked? <laughs> I just thought I was like, oh, fucking... <laughs> I guess if I'm wrecked or I'm scared, maybe both! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I guess now we talk to her about that man. About the man who stayed with you in your hotel room. Can you tell me about him? Where is he? Come on. No way, Jose! Uh, my name's not Jose. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, maybe if I had something to get her to talk. The wiretap? Why did she place a wiretap on Mia's phone? Oh, when you say it like that, it sounds so cold. So criminal! Um, tapping people's phones is a crime, Miss May. Oh, and I suppose you learned that in lawyer school? Hmm. Creep. This woman is impossible to talk to. Your attitude. <laughs> like, oh, when I'm kidding. <laughs> Say, why are you so angry? I mean, you don't look like a bad person. Oh, that does it. Bottom feeding scum sucking lawyer. Bottom? Cum sucking. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell. Does she have a thing against lawyers or just against me? Hmm. It's probably both, but mostly, yeah, mostly right. <laughs> Present? Okay, oh, right, something to make the talk. The wiretap? Um, I think we gotta move somewhere else. Mm, okay, well, let's show, let's show the wire. Oh, actually, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, we should move. Yeah, 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 that's a good idea. Uh, check anywhere else? The hotel. I would say the hotel. Yeah, you can move other place, uh, locations, if it... Doesn't show up like the, the time. It shows that uh, you're not uh, not supposed to be here, or that you're supposed to go here. Sorry. So I am supposed to be here. Uh, maybe one of the locations. But yeah. Ah, welcome, sir. Quite the performance today, I, if I do say so. I keep changing his voice because I have no idea what to put him as. Oh, um, thanks. Sorry for putting you on the spot like that. No, no, not at all, sir. Your efforts today can only help the Gatewaters rep, as they say. Huh? Rep? Yes, our reputation will swell as the hotel with the murder with the murder used a wiretap. We can change the premium for the room. Of course it will be great for business, sir. Whoa, whoa. Miss May hasn't been ch charged with murder. I, too, will become famous. The bellboy who brought the murder iced coffee. <laughs> Why do I feel like we're both stuck in the same bad dream? So, you are our honored guest. Please let me know if there's anything I can help you. Okay. I guess we'll talk to this dude. Thomas May. <clears throat> oh, her? Sir, not close, but I knew the moment I saw her. She'd do it. I <laughs> said. <laughs> Have you been in both ways? <laughs> do what? I'm starting to think the most suspicious person here is this guy. I wanted to ask you about the man who was with Miss May. Ah, yes. She struck me He struck me as a real lady killer, if you know part of the expression. I knew it from the moment I saw him, sir. He and I are on the same hook. We both carry the scent of danger. <laughs> there are in, to in total agreement, Mr. Psycho Bellboy. If you had the photo if if you had a photo of that man, I'm quite sure I could identify him. A photo? Hmm. Okay, then maybe I can look in the hotel. 
Could you tell me about this hotel? Absolutely. And on that subject, I have an excellent idea, sir. Currently, this hotel is known as the Gatewater. I propose that we add a subtitle. A subtitle? The Gatewater Hotel. Murder matter. <laughs> well, what do you think? Um, sounds great. Whatever floats your tea set. Okay, I want to examine. Okay, she was fucking... Huh? There's still screwdriver stuck in that drawer. Ah, please leave that as it is, sir. That's the drawer of terror hiding the place of the murderer's wiretap. It's just become the, one of the most popular attractions here. This guy is serious. I don't believe it. Okay, well... Okay, well... No clues here. Ah, I still see the painting. Wait, should that be still life? Whatever, one of those is hanging on the wall. Uh, nice weather again today. I can see the Fay and Cole Lofts, of course. Ah, yes, we plan to install a telescope. Just five dollars. You earn three minutes of a view to kill, to a kill. Just, just kidding, sir. Oh, oh. By the, by the, by that look in his eyes, said he was more than serious. A bottle and two glasses rest at the table. Why hasn't he cleaned these up by now? Ah, I beg your pardon, sir, but I could you please refrain from touching those? It's part of the decor. I call it the last streak before murder. We'll be famous, the talk of the hotel industry. Okay. Dead. A simple bed. It is recently made, nothing eye catching here. Try the flowers? Wait, hold on. The flowers? A vase, as expected. I'm not good with flower names, except maybe tulips and sunflowers. Oh, that's everything here. I think you gotta move somewhere else. Yeah, that's what it's looking like right now. Let's go here. Tell me some of those law offices. Huh, looks like Grossberg is out today. Again. Maybe he's avoiding me for some reason. Alright, there's a chance to examine. Oh, there you go. What's this? Old photos? These are two, there are two lying here. Something's been written in the pencil on the back. DL6 Incident, Exhibit A. DL6 Incident, Exhibit B. Let's take a look at these. I'm sure I've seen this person somewhere. Perhaps I'll borrow this photo. I'm sure no one will miss just one little photo. And there might be a valuable clue. I take, I'll take. i take it for now. Hmm. Can I, think, can I look at the other one? Oh, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> There's a murder. <laughs> a photo lies on the desk. Maybe I should switch it with the one I took. Oh, yeah, it's yeah that's a good idea. I think I sw I'll swap them. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Check the wall. Check the wall. Expensive looking maho mahogany bookshelf. Mahogany. <laughs> mahogany bookshelves filled with expensive looking books. Hmm, funny. They don't, they don't look like they've ever been read. To be fair... Who even reads those books? Up, those sh shelves of books? Huh? I don't really know. A solid mahogany desk. The wood's been polished to a deep luster. Okay. Uh, to the left a little bit up. What? Up. Uh, Among Us. This one. What? Um, oh, kind of, kind of looks like it, but a uh, little bit up. Oh, this right here. Yeah. Oh. Wait a second. Wasn't there a giant painting hanging on that wall? Yeah, yeah. It was a painting of. It was a fisherman. I believe so, yeah. Wasn't it? It was. It was a very memorable painting, anyhow. Okay, th and I think down here maybe I'll do something else, or it's uh, maybe something. Expensively potted plant. No idea what kind of plant it is, but it's probably the most expensive one available. And maybe this is not. Yeah. A table for clients. Hmm. An elegant ebony case. If I'm and if I'm not mistaken, that lighter is made of solid gold. Even I can tell someone's here got money to burn. Quite. <laughs> uh, I think that's it. You gotta move around. Yeah. To somewhere else. That is, I, yeah, I think that's it, actually. Wait, wait. There's one more. No? No, I think it's just the picture. Okay, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, it's just... Oh, no, you can oh, no wait, the, oh, the, oh, that's the, the picture. That's, that's the not picture. important right now. Yeah, that's the picture. All right, let's move. <sighs> let's go here and see if there's anything here, actually. I already, I already got my way of... Uh, Getting into her talk already. 
September 7th, Faye and Law Office. Okay. Looks like Forensics is taking the day off today. Detective Gumshoe is nowhere in sight. The police really gave this place a, wor a working over. I doubt there are any valuable clients left. Suppose it can't hurt to take a look around, though. Uh, I think it's a clues. Oh, well, it doesn't matter anyway. Ooh! <laughs> plant! Favorite potted plant. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess I had to water it now. No, you don't get it. Don't worry about it. The sky is blue, and so am I. What? There's that hotel right across the way. Uh... Okay, there's the phone. Mia's desk. Perfectly clean, as always. The only thing it's missing is Mia. Alright. I think... You couldn't cram more legal books in here, even if you wanted to. All the cases that the chief worked on are filed here. Hmm. Are there some files missing? Nah, I'm imagining things. Oh, that's interesting. An old movie poster. Apparently this was the first movie that made Mia cry when she saw it. I'll have to check it out one of these days. I think that's it. Yep, move. I think we're... Nah. Are we going to leave that for the next game? Uh, yeah, that's it. Alright then. We're good for today. Well, anyways... Ugh, yeah, dude, I forgot how fucking sick this game is, but it's long, holy fuck. I'm gonna fuck my own ass. I'm sorry, what?